Before I get into my thoughts on the trailers for the Super Bowl, can we just say how awesome those last two minutes are? I mean, I'm not too big on the Super Bowl. I mainly just watch it for the commercials, which there were some really funny ones this year. But, yeah, I'm trying to think. But, oh my gosh, those last two minutes were just great. So, yeah. So, first off, congrats to the Patriots. That was one hell of a game, like... I mean, I could go on and on about, but everyone else is going to go on about. So, I'm going to talk about the trailers that aired during the Super Bowl. I'm going to do them all in one video because they're very short. In some cases, I don't have much to say. In some cases, I've said a lot of what I'm going to say in other videos. So, let's get to it. So, during the pregame, they showed the trailer for Insurgent. Looks, uh, and I really, I haven't seen the first movie yet, but I have read the first book. I am curious to see what the second book is, so I'll check that out. Age of Ultron, it's still teasing and still showing footage that gets me pumped. The Spongebob movie still looks lame. Kingsman looks fun. Fifty Shades of Grey looks meh. The Jurassic World trailer, I mean, the movie's probably going to be mediocre, but the trailer is engaging, and it knows how to get me interested. Like, they're doing a good job teasing and selling the movie. Tomorrowland... The tr we finally got a bit more of the film. We still don't know quite what the story is, but I kind of like that. I'm not too excited. I think I'm, although I have to say, I'm not excited for the film based on the trailers. I'm only excited for it because Brad Bird's directing it. So, hopefully he'll do a good job. Terminator, no, Minions. I'd seen the ad before on YouTube. It's still amusing. Again, I don't think I mean, Illumination's a great studio, but they know how to market their films. Like, Despicable Me 2, not a great film, but it was really well marketed. And the, the studio knows that they don't have to show much to get people excited. Terminator Genesis, or whatever the heck it's called. Really don't care about it. Same shit as before. Um, if you want to see a good video that goes into detail about why this trailer sucks, just... Go watch Confuse Matthew. He pretty much nails it. Fast and Furious 7, lots of dumb action. It, it's very clear that they're running out of ideas and they've hit ridiculous levels. I mean, the fact that we're having a car drive out of a 40-story building and into another building just shows how ridiculous it's got. Pitch Perfect 2, a lot of sequels on the Super Bowl. Looks lame. I, again, I didn't hate the first one, but yeah, I just, i not interested in a sequel. And Ted 2... I mean, the gag was they did was decent, but the film looks stupid. I mean, after seeing through a million ways to die in the West and seeing, like, some of the stuff on Family Guy, I am, like, done with Seth MacFarlane. Like, like he needs to stop. And that's pretty much all I have to say on the Super Bowl trailers. Please leave your thoughts on them below. And also, if I forgot to talk about a Super Bowl trailer, please let me know. I'd be more than happy to talk about it. And that's all I have to say. So... This is Jay Starsu60 signing out.